Yeah. Andre, man, you okay? Yeah, no, that was stunning. That was really stunning. And I'm glad that's the last thing for, for today, filming-wise, because yeah. I think that's on a, it ends on a great note because... <laughs> Welcome back to another Chatterbox Patreon song reaction. Today, we're going to be reacting to Bohu, Such the Band, featuring Hadia Hashmi. And this is the Nest Cafe's Basement Session. Now, before we do that, I'm just going to quickly introduce the team today. We've got the man with the mega smile. You know it is. It's the ladies' love again. <laughs> <laughs> the oh, yeah. yeah, we need to get him doing a Colgate advert, man. Definitely. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, and then you know we've got the beautiful Joyce with us again. You know, making us look good as usual. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and then you know we've got the talented. You know, the wise. The old G <laughs> Dez. <laughs> nice. Yeah, so without further ado, we might as well jump in and take a look at this one. Yeah. So let's see what it's all about. Instrument. Yeah, and sponsored as well. Mm-hmm. I like the lyrics really. Yeah. You could hear all this down like the jazz cafe, man, back in the day. A very strong voice. I like the bass on the guitar as well. <laughs> I love that chorus. <laughs> 
It reminds me of um, MTV Unplugged. Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh, got a little, oh my gosh! Where are going there? She's so tiny! What is she doing there? <laughs> She's bringing the sound. How small is she? You're so tiny, that little child is so tiny. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Quite hypnotic as well. Mm. But she's singing like she's been doing this for 50 years. Yeah. That's emotion there, man. You see? Just see the fingertips. Yeah, it's, just, it's so passionate. Yeah. Wow, she got the mud there. Confidence there, yeah? Vein just pop. Yeah, you do, She's like an older person in a young yeah, person's body. In a body. tiny body, right? Yeah. Yeah, in a... mm. Stun everyone around you, that's what she's doing. Make small work for yourself, you see? She's on it, innit? That was powerful, man. That was, that was powerful. Yeah. too powerful. Yeah. Andre, man, you okay? Yeah, no, that was stunning. That was really stunning. And I'm glad that's the last thing for, for today, filming-wise, because yeah. I think that's on a, it ends on a great note because that had everything, like, the lyrics were mm -hmm. excellent, powerful. The song was great, the singing, the arrangement even just a simple video of them in a in a lounge or wherever it is, just playing the instruments and singing. The little girl was amazing. Her voice was mm -hmm. haunting in a great way. Mm -hmm. I just think everything about this was stunning. I was closing my eyes at certain points and listening to it. I was thinking about the lyrics. I was thinking about the lyrics and how it relates to myself. Like everything about it was good. I re great, great. Like I loved mm -hmm. it. I loved it. That, I felt that it. Yeah, that literally, like, it, it just touches your soul. From the moment that little, I mean, the band was amazing as well. The lead singer, his voice was so powerful, especially the chorus. I love that chorus. And you get to see all these different instruments and variations of instruments, things that I've never seen before. I didn't know it existed. So that was really unique to see. And I love to see jam sessions uh, between musicians. It's always so interesting to watch that. But literally, like, uh, it just it gives me, it gave me, like, all sorts of feelings. Um, the, like Andre said, the lyrics were so beautiful. And that little girl, she is a God's gift. Like, truly, like, she's a child prodigy. 
I mean, I don't even have to say that. I think that's so obvious. She's, like I said, she's like a 50 year old woman in a little tiny body. Like she, her voice is so powerful and it's just, it just hits you. Like, especially because she's so small and she's singing these meaningful lyrics. It's just like, that combination is just so amazing to watch. So I, I really, really enjoyed it. It was absolutely phenomenal, phenomenal. Gone, Des. Okay, yeah. Um, I, I, I really liked it. Uh, well, I enjoyed it. Actually, mm. um, it's quite an emotional journey there mm. as well. Um, it surprised me when the little girl came in, but even before that, just the lyrics. I was, I, I was hoping that the lyrics was going to come in in English, and it came in there. And what he was saying was quite meaningful. Yeah. Um, was able to read it and understand it and reflect upon it. And like Andre said, you start thinking about your own life. You think about lives of people. And when it came to that young girl, it was like, oh, my gosh, I wonder who first wrote the song mm. and how many times did she rehearse it? And, yes, it was a jam session. And I thought it was, like, done during COVID times because it was just them. But 2019, perhaps, no, it wasn't. And I, I would have loved to have been there just to be a part of an audience there, just a small audience. And that would have been mind blowing. You would just get carried away. You would just be floating on just the rhythmic of, of what's being said, what's being played, what's being felt. You just get carried away and float into a, a new dimension. And it's so spiritual as well. And it just kind of drew me in. And I just wanted to just listen and hear and understand and feel and think and it was all about the internal world. And I think it's wonderful. And like Andre said, man, it's a nice note to end on because this here, yeah, truly amazing. I enjoyed it. Yeah. And I've got to say, man, lovely words from Des, lovely words from all of you. Um, I think it was a really, really good song. Um, it was great. Um, as you said there, the lyrics are full. They were really powerful. Um, it definitely, I, I love that whole notion of, you know, looking inside um, yourself, um, you know, letting go of all your worries. Those types of words and those types of meanings, I think we can all apply those to our own individual lives. And I think um, they definitely touched on that in a very, very powerful way. And just adding that touch with the little girl, her voice was so, like, mesmerising. I think it might have been Andre who said that. Um, it was just, it was so touching. Um so yeah, thank you for that request um, because yes. you've let us into something that was a really great piece of work um, performance-wise um, and hopefully we can look at some more stuff like this um, in the future. So, um, yeah. And just to say, I love the violin. I love any stringed instruments. Violin, the cello, oh my gosh, just bring it and... I, th I think it's connected to just your heart. Yeah. The strings of your heart. It's just the, the veins, the arteries. I think there's one connection there. And each time they just strum, oh, it's just mind blowing. It's just wonderful. It's just yep. wonderful. Yeah, definitely. Um, yeah. So, again, thank you for the request. Um, thank you for watching. Oh. Thank you all for continuing to support us on Patreon because you guys are the main ones that keep us going. Um, mm -hmm. We love doing what we do. We love providing these reactions for you guys. We're enjoying what we do. So, yeah, stay tuned. Um, we're going to be bringing a lot more content, um, a lot more watch-alongs, music, song reactions. So thank you again from the whole team, everyone. I know P's not here. But he also sends his thanks as well. Yeah. So, yeah, that has been our reaction. And we're signing out. Peace. Peace.